here's the procedure that I use when I insert an image. First, click where you want the image to go. I'm going to click right up here. Then choose Add Media. Click Upload Files. And then Select Files. Navigate to where your image is. And here's my image over here. Click Open. Now it's uploading over here. You can watch the progress. So you wait a little bit. And now it's ready. Now here's the title of the file right over here. And I've named it Internet Marketing and then insert a picture in WordPress. So Internet Marketing is my contains my blog keywords and then I have keywords for this specific post. So what you want to do is you want to select the whole name. I'm going to right click and choose select all and then you're going to copy it to the clipboard. And you're going to go down here to alt text and right click and paste. So now I have these keywords in my alt text, which is good for search engine optimization. Scroll down, and you want to select the alignment. In my case, I want it to be at the right. And then it has a link here. And it usually links by default to the file itself, but I don't see any reason to do that. So I choose none. If it's a picture of a product, then I would link it to the sales page. But in this case, none. And then finally, you want to choose a size. In this case, full size is way too big. I almost always use medium for the beginning of a blog post. So now I have it all set up and I click insert into post. And there it is. So I'm going to save the draft and click preview to look at it. And here you can see how it looks. It's over on the right. It fits very nicely at this size. And as soon as people see the blog post, they see the image and it provides some interest. So people are more likely to read it. And the picture also helps my search engine optimization.